Welcome back everyone, my name is Micah, and today we are playing episode 2 with the Create Mod and Survivor's Elegy. Now, on last video, uh, I received a comment from Sisku. Uh, Sisku is the dev behind uh, Survivor's Elegy, and uh, they told me a few things. Um, number one, uh, check the Advancements tab which I will do. Um, not all zombies can zombify you. When you find the one, it will become apparent, which is, is good. Uh, I, I just assumed that I would be infected upon like being attacked by a zombie, but I guess there is um, some sort of differentiating factor visually um, about the zombie or otherwise that sets it apart from normal zombies. And uh, charged armor is cool. Just keep playing and it will come into action. Because, okay... I'm super happy about that because I was convinced that I was just going to get struck by lightning because my armor is receiving charge. Um, and also, there's a new update out. Uh, this is Alpha 8.0, which I installed just this morning. It was released this morning. So yeah, let's get into it. I want to see if I can build a house today. Um, you know, normal Minecraft stuff. Charge of complete. Are you serious? Headset, do you know who I am? All right, first things first, I want to build, like, an actual house. I mean, I love the... I have a love-hate relationship with the tent over here. Like, I mean, it's fine. This is the only thing we actually have gotten from the Create mod, these chairs. But still, hey, they're, they're cool, and I like them. What do I... let's see. One piece of dripstone. Yes! But hey, with this update, our copper armor is now less durable than iron, which I kind of assumed it was. So I'm not really, I'm not really surprised. I kind of expected that. But if it wasn't, I mean, that way before, it is now. So. Also, thank you very much, Sisku, for, for leaving a comment on last video. Very helpful, very cool data pack. I'm having the time of my life, dude. It's it's just birch and oak. Now listen, oak is a classic, but I'm not building with birch. Say all you want about birch. It's it's fine, but it's not for me. It's it's very it's it's got its own zest. And I don't mean like the internet way. I, I don't mean like that. It's just, it's a zesty color. It feels zesty. It feels tropical. The fact that I have to explain myself. You know, I might actually have a use for diorite. I said diorite. Diorite this time around. Um, in reality, I'll probably use calcite for what I'm going to build here. I want to make like a, I don't know what you call it, but like, Kind of like a one of those houses that's got like the wood frame and then like the white kind of it almost looks like canvas i know it's not canvas but you'll get what i'm going for once i actually build it or start on it is that powdered snow yeah that's powder snow oh Oh, I saw that. Oh, that's the brute shield. That thing looks so cool. I forgot that was in the uh, the data pack. Oh wait, I want to make that. Do I even have any gold? Probably not. Look, powder snow in real life is not fun. I went skiing once and I got like stuck up to my knees in powder snow. Then the surface area of the skis made it hard to pull my legs out. <laughs> oh, I just need a few more gold to make that super cool brute shield. Man, I'm looking forward to that. Like, little cosmetic changes. So cool. 
So cool. Alright. I also increased uh, days again. They're now double what they were, so they're 40 minutes rather than 20. Then I go up. I actually haven't even used this feature. I always just avoid powder snow. I want to bring some of the spruce trees down with me because I don't want to have to climb up this mountain every time I want spruce wood. It's only the best wood type in the game. Why wouldn't I? Whoa! Whoa, 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 what was that? Is it like built-in thorns when you have charge? Yeah, there's like blue, I guess, sparks. And just finish them off like that. Uh. I guess now I'm looking at every zombie to kind of gauge whether or not it's even smart to fight them because I would assume once you're zombified, the only cure is like a golden apple and a weakness potion and I don't have brewing stands I don't have a golden apple well I might have a golden apple I don't know but I definitely don't have weakness potions yeah! leave me alone oh! go away oh Ow, 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 no, no, please. Leave me alone. Help. They've ruined me. They threw me in a hole and left me to die. Thing is, I'm going to have to try a lot harder than that. Whoa. I'm putting sticks on the campfire. Dude. Would you look at that? And we get torches in return. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna need... A dog. Are you serious? I don't have any bones. I want bones! <gasps> One. Yes! <laughs> Alright, come on. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put you over here by the tent so you can uh guard my stuff. Carl. Your name's Carl. You got that? Dude, yeah. Carl the dog, man. Carl with a K, so he's like a little bit cool, you know? Is there just like a bunch of iron at like mountain tops now? I actually didn't really know that. That's our first emerald. I've got a feeling like, I mean, we're gonna be making machines. I've got a feeling like we're gonna need iron. Here's the thing, I just thought about the fact that Survivor's Elegy removes, like, dungeons. So I can't make, like, a, a zombie grinder, I can't make, like, a skeleton grinder. And I understand that, because they're very farmable, and uh, they don't want those spawners to be farmable. So I'm going to have to find a different way to make 
um, like an auto coal farm, not auto coal farm, auto tree farm, because I won't be able to grind out bone meal unless I use something like a composter, which I don't really, I'm gonna have to watch like a mumbo jumbo video, there's more emeralds down there. Well, there's two villages down there. I wonder what war would break out over this territory if they found out there were emeralds up here. Ay! Oh, you scared me. You're a snow fox. Forgot those guys existed. I only see the orange ones. Um, what I'll do is I'll find one more vein and I'll call it a day or night because it is night. And I fear for my village's safety. They're nothing without me. Okay. Um, eight shovels later. Four pickaxes. I think we can start building. I mean, look at this thing. Yeah, that's just from um, clearing out what was over here before. It used to come up to, like, right here. Which, I mean, it took, like, over an hour. But then again, I did eat lunch and watch a YouTube video. In between then. So. You know, I've got to say, I highly recommend, I highly advise against doing this um, with so many logs and all that, but it came to me in a dream, so I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> um... All right, we can keep the armor safe right here. Oh, good. Oh, I'm so glad it works on armor stands. That's awesome. Look how cool it looks. I like how big the helmet is. That is... Man. All right. Onward and downward, I guess. <laughs> Hello? What is this? We found something new. Viridian. Looks like you can make... Oh, that's a nice color. Viridium, huh? Dude, yes. Could make a roof out of that. Here's her. Oh. Oh no. Um, what do I want to do here? What do I want to do about this? Okay, um... As soon as I was saying, oh, we're, we're not going to find a deep dark down here, I had to open my fat mouth. And look what there is. I'm not seeing any shriekers, however. That doesn't mean I don't want to get rid of these things. Freaking A, dude. 
Where is the thingy? Stop, 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 do it. Stop doing all that, dude. What is this? Well, I know exactly what it is, but this is a... Ooh. Sorry for not putting down any torches, but... I, I don't really want to risk it. Because if there is a shrieker, I mean... I, I'm kind of lost in this cave, I'm not going to lie. Oh good, it just keeps going. Uh oh. Is that a shrieker? No, it's a catalyst. Oh god. Tell me about it, cave sound. I'm freaking out. Whoa! New stuff! This would be perfect for the build I'm going for. It's a shame it's covered in skulk. What is it? Limestone, dude. Very cool. Now, do I really have to be sneaky? Like, let's say if I just ran around. I mean, I don't see any shriekers anywhere. Shut up! Shut up! I don't care what they hear. I'll just mine it all. You know the danger you're causing me, dude? Get out of here. You must die. That just scared me so bad. I also forgot about that advancement. Shut up! Skulk is annoying! Where are you? Your cattle is hidden. Maybe XP. Uh-oh. I know what I see down there, and I don't like it one bit. I think we've just found an ancient city. Can you stop stealing my XP? I would appreciate it. Thanks. I just want to confirm my suspicions. Oh, no. Oh, my God. <sighs> this will make for a great episode. <gasps> I was going to make a staircase. Man, I'll take some diamonds. Eight of them, too. Look at that. Okay, time to actually make the staircase out of here now. This is gonna be my way out, isn't it? Please. I was in a mountain this whole time, dude. And what did I tell you? I told you there's going to be an ancient city under here. So let's get started. <gasps> Whoa, hold on, hold on. It's doing something in there. Whoa! Oh my god! Alright, six charge. Four charge. Zero charge. Zero charge. No, it didn't uh, collect charge, but it is oxidizing. 
That is very cool. Oh, man. Like, I've got a feeling that the limestone plus spruce combo is just hideous. Especially, like, when they just converge. Like, But I don't know. I'm very critical of myself when I build. So, I mean, it could be just fine. Maybe it needs glass panes and... Well, it definitely does, but... It needs some, some TLC. We're level 30. I think we have the perfect amount. Almost the entire suit is oxidized. That is so freaking cool, dude. I think this is how... Oh crap, advancements. Oh, well I needed less... Okay. Ah! Oh. Look at that thing. Hold on. Yeah, so you just kind of hold up your arm. Because that thing is the shield. That's the thing that the piglins use. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I don't think it adds any other protection other than just being like an alternate shield. But, dude, I appreciate that so much. Hold on, I want to look at something. Look at how that matches with my skin. Oh, man. That's, that's cool. Does it count? I wonder if piglins wouldn't attack you in the nether. If you're if you're wearing this thing. All right, so I'm back. Uh, loaded up the world again. Um, I want to. I've been looking at like simple machines for the create mod. Where is my armor? Put that back on. Yeah, but um, I was thinking also I would just like to do these uh, once a week, maybe once every Saturday or Sunday. Uh, because I have been working on larger projects uh, in the background here on and off. Well, not on and off, but consistently working on them. They're, they're large projects. I have a 20-page script uh, <laughs> for a video coming up. So, yeah, I would like to do maybe maybe once, twice a week on the, on the Let's Plays. Let me know what you guys think about that, if you'd like to see more or less of them. Um... Yeah, just let me know. I'm a huge fan of this shield, also. Finally, dude. Got an antisite alloy. Got no idea what that does. But hey, I have one. You know what? I feel like we're going to need a lot of these. So I'm just going to... I'm just going to make a lot of them. Um, also, I don't like antisite, so get rid of it. All right, let's... I'm going to try and set something up. Do I need super glue? I know you use super glue a lot in this mod. I don't... Oh, I have super glue. Uh, no, help. Help me. If I, uh, uh, oops. Yeah, you do that. Uh, oh, good. Oh, oh yes, that is, that's, yep, that's a shaft, all right, um, uh... oh, I can make that, dude, Um, 
radial chassis if I want it to spin around, right? Because the other one was linear. Um, uh, um, um, <laughs> yeah, um, I'm gonna put that up there. Put those over here. Oh my god. It works. And then oh wow, that's really cool. Um can I not do any more? Alright. Uh no sp no spin. No no spin around. Oh, it, it's lagging the game. Oh. <gasps> Dude. It's the first machine. Okay, so that's a source of energy, right? Uh, well, it's going slow. I mean, it's a windmill. What did I expect? And that means... It's not spinning. Can I help you, bro? Look, I get you're the shepherd and all, but like, that's mine. You can't have that wool, dude. He's so mad. Look at him. He's hopping mad, if you will. Alright, alright. I need you to... to Cut that out for a second, windmill. Stop it! Will this add more... Stop following me! Get away from me! Stop! I'll... I'll act in self-defense. Is that going any faster to you? Stop. I hate that guy. Ah, help. Ah, ah, oh, God. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with a, with a machine. It's fun. Right, so there's the floor plan. This is going to be like a patio entrance thing, front porch. But like, it's going to be two stories. I'm going to have like a tower that comes out of this part. Uh, of course, that tree will be gone. So, And then it'll probably go up three, four stories, I guess. Uh, it's going to be it's gonna be nice. I have built a house similar to it that I really liked. Uh, unfortunately, when I had my hard drive wiped... Um, due to some kind of like bug i lost the world that i built this house on so i kind of want that that feel back so i think we'll we'll set up we'll set up a farm using that thing over there the windmill which might i add is still really cool look at it go and then we'll of course add on to this uh actually put a roof on it and some glass and we might go to the deep dark that's uh over there uh, over there somewhere but yeah thank you all for watching this episode of uh my minecraft modded let's play with the create mod and the uh, survivor's elegy data pack which adds really cool things <laughs> like this shield right here and this copper sword dude that is still so cool. But yeah, I'm going to uh, edit this video, get it out as quickly as I can, while still ensuring quality, mind you. Or as, as uh, quality as I can, because I suck at editing. And uh, I guess optimizing OBS settings. <laughs> but nonetheless, thank you all for watching. My name has been Micah, and I will see you all next week for the next episode.